Artificial intelligence is probably one of the most overused words these days. And one of the biggest questions, will artificial intelligence replace humans? But think about this, when humans tried to look at birds and learn how to fly, they didn't build birds, they built aeroplanes. They learned the principles of aerodynamics, they used it in order to benefit humanity itself. In the same manner, we are currently studying human intelligence in order to make our products and processes much more efficient, ultimately benefiting us humans. So, if you are really interested in artificial intelligence, I believe this is one of the best times to specialize in this field by pursuing a master's degree. What is Masters in Artificial Intelligence? Through the MS in AI program, you can build strong fundamentals in machine learning, natural language processing, robotics, computer vision, etc. And also pursue advanced coursework in knowledge retrieval systems, in reinforcement learning, deep learning, etc. Skills in these subjects uh, will enable you to make processes more efficient and work on cutting edge products that are currently revolutionizing the world. As multinational companies across the world are trying to integrate artificial intelligence in order to make their processes more efficient, in order to uh, you know, move into more advanced software systems that can save them money, save them time, etc. They will be looking out for professionals who have these skills and a deep understanding of uh, you know, applying artificial intelligence. According to Payscale, in the USA, master's graduates with AI skills are earning on an average of $102,000 per annum. And as you gain experience, that pay can increase drastically to upwards of $200,000 per annum in a very short duration of time based on the skills and the experience and the capabilities you gain. Post-graduation, you can apply to job roles such as machine learning engineer, data scientist, data engineer, robotics engineer, etc. You can also apply to traditional software developer roles, uh, roles in which you will be using ML skills um, in order to uh, you know, work on better products. These jobs are not only restricted to the IT industry, but MNCs across diverse sectors like FMCG, biopharma, medicine, finance, supply chain, governance, agriculture, etc are looking for uh, employees with AI skills. Beyond jobs, if you want to get into research or entrepreneurship, I believe AI is one of the best fields at the moment because you know universities, corporations, venture capitalists worldwide are funding heavily. Who is eligible to pursue a master's in AI? Now, students with background in computer science, IT, uh, electronics and communications engineering can directly apply for MS in AI courses. Now, students uh, from other STEM fields need to pursue online coursework in programming, um, operation systems, data structures, etc. in order to be eligible to apply for MSAI. Now, non-IT students uh, can also pursue a master's in data science and then specialize in AI. Now, let's look at some universities that are offering master's in artificial intelligence. A point to note is that unlike uh, master's in computer science or data science that universities across the USA offer, MS in Artificial Intelligence is offered by just a few uh, universities. In Tier 1, we have Carnegie Mellon University, Northwestern University, etc. In Tier 2, we have Boston University, Northeastern University, Iowa State University, etc. In Tier 3, we have Stevens Institute of Technology, Illinois Institute of Technology, and uh, University of Michigan, Dearborn, etc. Many students ask me the question, should I pursue MS AI, which is very specialized? Or should I choose more broader courses like Masters in Computer Science or Masters in Data Science? It requires students to have a research bent of mind. You should be passionate about researching and finding new ways or solutions to complex problems. Now, if you are someone with that kind of research bent, then AI will be a great path for you. But if you're someone who's just interested in AI, um, you want to learn more about it, but not really sure if uh, you know that really matches your interests, etc., then I would suggest you take uh, a broader MS in Computer Science or MS in Data Science course. And while pursuing this course, you can also take electives in AI. In conclusion, AI is a great field to specialize in, 
uh, the skills that you develop will be in demand uh, for the next 5 to 10 years across the world. However, you should be passionate about the field in order to excel in your career in the field of artificial intelligence. I hope that was helpful. Please comment below if you have any questions or suggestions regarding what videos I should work on next. Uh, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to this channel. Thank you so much for listening.